Hello everyone. In this video I'll be showing you how to use the Coralpleth mapping function in MapMaven. So first off you're going to want to be in your layers tab of your admin panel and go to the layer that you want to make the Coralpleth map of. So we're going to click on that layer. This is a layer of uh, voting statistics from the 2008 presidential election in Colorado. So if we just go to styles then we can see that there is a drop down for color progressions or Coralpleth mapping. Open that up and you can choose an attribute to base it on. So for this example, we're gonna choose the number of votes for Democrats. And you can see that it popped up automatically with a blue color ramp because that is the uh, color that is automatically chosen by the system. But if you wanna change that, you can just click on it and it'll open up um, this drop down or pop up with several other different color options. And if you want to set the color options yourself, you click set range and you can see that um, there's the color ramp chosen for you with a number of stops which you can either delete or add more of. You can click on the color to change it, change the stop values, um, as well as change the specific labels of each stop value on the legend. So um, there's a lot of customization you can do. You can also do color smoothing, if you turn that on right there, as well as rebalance the uh, steps evenly, or the stops evenly. So if I change the value and I want to bring it back to the original, I can just click that. And then finally, you can also customize the attribute legend label. So since this is the number of Democratic votes, if I want to make that look a little better, a little easier to read, I can say number of Democratic votes. And that will show up on the map as the legend label. And then I can also change the color when no data. So I can make that white if I wanted to, or make that fully transparent. Um, so that way it doesn't interfere with the map. And that's about everything. Thanks for listening.